I'm here with men's soccer head coach, Coach Olszewski, after a one nothing win against Georgia State. Coach, the teams were pretty even in the first half. What did you say to the team at halftime? Well, the, uh, the game went back and forth. I mean, they, they came at us a little bit at the beginning of the game. I think our players responded very well. Made some, they made some adjustments on the field, which that's where they have to make them because, again, and as we always know about this game, you can't call a timeout. So they have to make the adjustments on the field, which they did. Came in at halftime, and we just said we've got to get that first goal. Mateo was the lone goal today. Uh, talk a little bit about his goal. Yeah, I mean, it, it, was, a, it was a nice passing sequence that started from uh, the, the, the left side. A couple nice passes to get through midfield, and then, uh, you know, he had patience waiting on the outside, and he, and he placed it just right. Georgia State had an offensive push toward the end of the game. What did your defense do to keep them out of the net? Well, anytime you get to the end of the game, they're going to play. They're going to go a little more direct. They're going to throw a little more numbers forward, and you know it, it becomes a mentality, and you've got to be able to deal with that. That's where mental toughness comes in. And what impressed you most about your team today? Uh, the resiliency and the and the fact that we did it as a team. It wasn't an individual effort, and and uh, defensively we hung in there just like we wanted to. The Tigers hold a 7-1 record overall against Georgia State, and this was their last game in the CAA Conference. How does it feel to get that win? Well, I mean, that's always a good win, and uh, you know, and we'd probably like to have them in the conference again, you know, based on that. But uh, I mean, they're, they're, it's been they're, the the rivalry's been uh, very intense. Every game has been close, and uh, you know, we, you can never take the, the team like that for granted. They're a good team. They're a well-coached team, and they went to the NCAA tournament. And you know, I mean, it was our day today. All right, thank you, Coach. Congratulations. Thank you. Matteo Vertucci, the score of the lone goal today in the Tigers' victory over Georgia State. Talk to us a little, about, little bit about your goal. I mean, it was a good play overall, and uh, it was four passes. Then Kay gave, gave me a very good pass, and I just had to just control and shoot. And I mean, I did the easiest stuff. Like, they, they did the hard stuff, passing me in the bottom, working around, and I just had to finish. And how did your team come up with this victory? I mean, there was a late offensive push. What did you guys do to keep in the game? I mean, we practiced like very hard all week, and uh, we were like uh, like practicing like going on the outs on the wings. And what we didn't practice, we did in the game, and we pulled off a good victory. It was a good way to start the CAA. Yeah, how does it feel to be undefeated in the CAA so far? I mean, it's one game. Like uh, it was important to win this game. Like do good, uh, not not concede any goals. And now we have to like, I'm um, like we're happy. And now we have to concentrate from tomorrow to JMU and uh, get a result also there. Hey, Tiger Town! Be a part of the uproar and get your Towson football tickets today. See the Tigers take on the Maine Black Bears in their next home game Saturday, October 13th at 7 p.m. in Johnny United Stadium. Enjoy the excitement of Tiger football as we welcome back everyone for Family Weekend. This is also a pink game, so be sure to show your support by wearing pink. It's the Tigers' next home game against Maine, October 13th, 7 p.m., Johnny United Stadium. For tickets, visit TowsonTigers.com or call 1-855-TU-TIGER. Don't miss out.